Microsoft co-founder Paul Allen, unveiled the world's largest aircraft on Wednesday. The massive plane rolled out by Allen's aerospace firm, Strata Launch Systems, features the longest wingspan of any aircraft ever built, according to Popular Mechanics. With a wingspan of 385 feet, the six-engine plane will be larger than Howard Hughes' 1947 H-4 Hercules, known as the Spruce Goose, and the Antonov N-225, a Soviet-era cargo plane originally built to transport the Buran space shuttle that is currently the world's largest aircraft. The Strata launch is an aircraft that is designed to carry rockets between its two fuselages. In 2011, the project's cost was initially estimated to be at $300 million, though there is no word as to the updated figures. After the plane reaches altitude, it would then drop the launch vehicle, which will subsequently fire its boosters and launch into space from the air. Images of the mammoth plane, nicknamed the Rock, were released Wednesday. It shows the plane emerging from its hangar in California's Mojave Desert. The plane was built by Scaled Composites, an aerospace company founded by Allen's partner in the Strata Launch project, Bert Rutten. Scaled is owned by defense contractor Northrop Grumman. The Strata Launch weighs approximately 500,000 pounds without any cargo. It is designed to carry a maximum takeoff weight of 1.3 million pounds, according to The Verge. The plane rolls around with the aid of 28 wheels. Once airborne, it is powered by six 747 aircraft engines. The size of the plane will enable it to serve as an airborne rocket launcher. Traditionally, satellites and other aircraft have been launched into space from a launch pad. This requires a tremendous amount of fuel. The Strat launch, on the other hand, will enable rockets to have a head start since they will be carried into the sky before they launch into space. Last year, Strata Launch signed a deal with aerospace and defense firm Orbital ATK. Under terms of the deal, the Strata Launch will propel Orbital's Pegasus XL rocket, which is used to send small satellites into space. Allen's move coincides with a surge of new businesses planning to sell Internet access, Earth imagery, climate data and other services from networks of hundreds of satellites in low-altitude orbits around Earth. But, his vision is different from what Elon Musk's SpaceX, Jeff Bezos' Blue Origin, Richard Branson's Virgin Galactic and other companies have for building commercial highways to space. Musk's goal is to fly people to Mars. Bezos is developing low-cost, reusable rockets with the goal of moving energy-intensive, heavy industry off Earth. Branson is focused on space tourism and a small satellite launcher. The advantage of Allen's approach will be the ability to position the plane, so satellites can be directly delivered into very precise orbits and do so quickly, without launch range scheduling issues and weather-related delays, Chuck Beams, who oversees Allen's space ventures, said. The Strata launch plane looks nothing like its behemoth predecessor aircraft. Rather than transporting heavy cargo inside a main body section, Strata Launch is a twin fuselage craft that incorporates engines, landing gear, avionics and other parts from a pair of Boeing 747 jets coupled with a frame, wings and skin handmade of lightweight composites. Designed and built by Northrop Grumman Core Scaled Composites, the plane is similar in form and function to Scaled's aircraft built to ferry spaceships into the air and release them for independent rocket rides beyond the atmosphere, a service Richard Branson's Virgin Galactic intends to offer to paying passengers. Strata Launch plans a similar service for satellites, particularly the low Earth orbiting multi hundred member constellations under development by companies including SpaceX and Google's Terra Bella to provide Internet access, Earth imagery, and other data. But Strata Launch will offer quick and precise satellite positioning, a service that will set it apart from competitors. These satellite networks, based on low-cost spacecraft, are the fastest-growing segment of the global satellite industry, which reported more than $208 billion in revenue 2015, according to a Satellite Industry Association report.